Governor Mike Kehoe is kicking off his campaign for governor in central Missouri. Our Missouri Chief Capitol Bureau reporter Emily Manley was the only St. Louis television station covering the event, and she explains why Kehoe is throwing his name in the hat to be the state's next top leader. I don't want anybody in this room to think I'm counting, but there's 448 days to the primary. After being appointed lieutenant governor in June of 2018, Probably the most humbling phone call I ever got, uh, starting from the roots that I did in North St. Louis City with a single parent and the youngest of six. Mike Kehoe wants to become Missouri's 58th governor. We need somebody who's a leader, who understands how to move things forward and come up with solutions to, to fix problems that make our state a better place to live and work. I think I can do that. Addressing supporters Tuesday night just outside of Jefferson City, Kehoe says he will focus on growing workforce development and the state's economy. And it's why I ran for office in the first place, to bring a small businessman's perspective to state government. In an interview before the event, Kehoe says combating crime is his main priority, saying if Missourians don't feel safe in their community, they aren't free. No matter where they live, large or small, they want law enforcement in their areas. They want safe communities. We need to get the local leaders to understand there's ways to do that, and we need to get back on that path. Besides small business owners, the former Missouri senator and his wife Claudia are first generation cattle ranchers in southern Missouri. The father of four says it's time for the state to invest in child care. And a key piece of that workforce development in companies large and small is the ability for Missourians to find accessible and affordable child care. Now, Kehoe will have some competition in the August 2024 primary. Earlier this year, Republican Secretary of State Jay Ashcroft announced he's running for governor. We also expect later this year that Republican Senator Bill Eigel will also announce his bid. As for the Democrat side, no one has yet to come forward to run for governor. Reporting from Missouri Capitol Bureau in Holt Summit, I'm Emily Manley.